Hey guys, what's up? Alien One Tech here, and your news for today is about EA banning people. And not banning for the reasons you think, but reasons that are really bizarre and, well, really dumb. And if you want to know more about this, all you have to do is wait right after my intro. So stay tuned. Alright, great, so now that you guys are back, EA, also known as Electronic Arts, has been catching a lot of heat for their really stupid policy that bans customers from their legally bought games for cursing and breaking rules on the forums. I know, right? That sounds pretty dumb to me. Now, despite all their bad publicity that they're getting, however, EA is not changing this or fixing this issue anytime soon. The sad thing is, is that it's actually getting worse. Now I know you're thinking to yourself, how can this get worse, right? Well, let me tell you, the latest victim of EA's ridiculous behavior is from a guy named Aaron. Now this guy got banned because somebody else swore. Now I know you're probably confused right now, so let me give you the backstory to this. Now what happened was is that someone actually abused Aaron on EA's form with a swear flavored kind of rant. And what this guy did is that he included his username at the end of the post. Okay, now get this. This is where it gets really dumb and ridiculous. Now, rather than banning the offender, they actually banned the recipient just because his username was at the scene of the crime. I know, right? That doesn't even make any sense. Now, the real sad part about all of this is that this guy named Aaron is now unable to access and play Battlefield 3 and get this, Battlefield Bad Company 2, even though it was purchased on Steam. Now even though that part was pretty sad and pretty dumb, you would think, okay, this ban will last about what, 7 days, 10 days, 12 days, maybe even 30 days, about a month or so? Well, not even close. This ban is actually permanent, and it will not be lifted up. That is what I call ridiculous. Well guys, that's the end of this video because you've heard from me, you've heard from EA, but I have not heard from you, and that's who I want to hear from. What do you guys think about EA's ridiculous policy, and what would you guys do about it? Also, do you guys know anyone that this has happened to? Well, leave them all down in the comments below. And of course, while you're down there, you can check out my alien box for my Facebook account where I post up my latest videos and other things that I think you might like. And also, if you have not seen my latest videos, you can check them out right here. And I'll definitely see you guys in my next video. This is Alien1Tech signing out. Bye.